the Philippines, home to over 7,000 islands and some of the most biodiverse regions on the planet. Yet even though our nation has been blessed as a center of marine biodiversity on Earth, we are quickly depleting our natural resources. One of the biggest issues facing our marine ecosystems is destructive bottom trawling. Bottom trawling is a method of destructive fishing that can devastate the ocean floor. Fishing boats employ large fishing gears that scrape the bottom of the ocean, forcing all marine life into their nets. While these trawls are often used to catch shrimp and squid, they do so at the expense of our marine habitats and end up dragging all manner of sea life, including baby fish, urchins, sea turtles, and more. Many times, these additional catches are simply wasted and are thrown back into the water, dead or dying. Even worse, because of the nature of trawling devices, the homes of these sea creatures are also wrecked in the process. Studies, such as one conducted in northern Iloilo, have projected that in five years, almost one billion pesos would be needed to restore ocean habitats from trawling damage. Yet it would only cost a fraction of that price for municipal and commercial operators to leave trawl fishing. This leaves no natural habitat for these creatures and makes it harder for species to thrive and multiply, which in turn leaves our oceans empty for the future. As a result, local fishermen who rely on these fish are also affected as the trawlers steal their catches, destroy the local fishing gears, and also wreck the chances for local species to bounce back and repopulate. Every year, as trawling operations clear out more of the ocean floor, these trawling boats have to spread their operations to new areas, since they often wipe out the areas they trawl in. Provinces all over the Philippines have tried to stop these trawlers, but they keep finding ways to continue operations. This practice is so damaging that the Philippines has been passing laws to limit the practice from as far back as 1954. Today, all trawling is illegal within 15 kilometers of our shorelines, yet due to corruption and poor law enforcement, the practice continues, further wrecking ocean habitats and stealing livelihoods away from our country's rural fishermen. Oceana is currently working with our local and national governments to try and find ways to improve our enforcement of these laws and to protect our ocean habitats and fishers for the future. However, we need your help to do so. By doing things such as educating your community about the impacts of bottom trawling, reporting fishing violations to your local authorities, or spreading awareness about bottom trawling, you can make a huge difference in the fight to restore our oceans. Click the link below and visit ph.oceana.org to learn more about how we can stop bottom trawling together.